Greetings, special centurions, and welcome, fellow YouTubers, back to Oblivion. We are currently in the Imperial City Market District, having just explored Fort Major over here, and then come back, sold everything, and bought ourselves a magic new helmet that increases our magicka by 15, which is very nice. Uh, I'm now going to go and rest in the in the arena to get some sleep to level up and then i think we're going to progress with the thieves guild because i need more if we if, if there's anything we could learn from the excursion into fort major it's that we're not powerful enough yet to be going into fortresses and exploring and discovering places the only place left on the map that we've discovered but not yet explored is uh all the way down here is this alien ruin they on so i'll just keep that in mind uh and then we'll go and carry on doing the thieves guild missions uh and trying to get our loot up our money up and our um equipment up by doing that for a while yeah rest now we'll turn more vampire now you level uh, so blah, blah, blah. you have ascended to level 15 now you just stay at your peak as long as you can there's no one stronger in tamriel but there's always someone younger a new challenger i'll take five willpower i'll take ugh, only two in endurance really that sucks two endurance five willpower and i will take three strength Uh, we've read we've read this one before. The flesh of your hands begins to bubble, crack, and fall off. Yeah. Well met. Yes, it is well met indeed. So for the thieves' guild, we need to go to. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba, Elven maiden, Shaden Hall. Yeah, we need to go to Shaden Hall. But it's daytime and we can't fast travel. So is there anything we can do in the meantime? Let me have a look. Let me have a think. 3.25 p.m., which means we can't feed on anyone because no one will be asleep at this point. Um, there's no more missions to do around here, is there? We're just going to have to wait, I think. Version of the Grey Prince, unfriendly competition. We can't do till night. Door in Nibbon Bay. Desolate Mine, join the Mages Guild, Chaden Hall recommendation. Oh, we, can, we can do that now as well. Oh, Venerable Vintage. We picked up a couple of um, we picked up a couple of bottles of wine, didn't we? So let's go hand those in while we're waiting for night to fall. It'll get them out of our inventory and it'll give us a little bit more cash. Hello. Don't tell me what to do. And then we can wait at the inn for nightfall. Maybe feed off her again. Like we did last time. See if the guard actually gives a shit this time. And then uh, fast travel up to Chadenhall. And then start doing missions up in Chadenhall. I think there's a couple of missions we can get done in Chadenhall that give us a bit of gold. So, yeah. How are you enjoying retirement, buddy? Is it going well? I'm looking forward to my retirement. 
Long days in the stable with the horses. No more fish. Where are your savings? I don't trust you enough. Ah, let's find out where we'll his savings see. are. He doesn't like admiration. So he hates top right. What? What? My life is drab and wretched by comparison. Yeah, it is. Let's enthrall him. Do we have vampires seduction? We do. Farewell. I'm looking forward to So he should be at 100%. Certainly. Oh, he's 88. Okay. Where are your savings? Well, I'll tell you a secret. I took some of the money I saved and paid a mage to lock the rest of it away in a box inside my house. Nothing can open it except for this key right here. And there ain't no way anyone is getting this key while I'm still breathing. Oh dear, you shouldn't yes, have said sir. that. I worked too hard to collect that money. I'm not about to let anyone steal it from me. That was a big mistake telling me that. Captain Lex blame. Farewell. Right, you should not have told me that, son. Let's crouch, let's turn invisible so he can't see us. And then let's pick his pocket. Oh, what? He, he knows we're here. He must be able to hear us. Let's uh, take off our armor. Give me a second, let me doff my armor. Right, now my armor's doffed. I should be able to get up behind him without him knowing I'm... Fuck's sake. Really? Okay. Stop, thief. Damn it. Our, our fucking pickpocketing is terrible. <clears throat> we got it, chat. We did it. Twenty-four gold. That's so funny. That's so fucking funny. That's why I was doing it. I didn't really care about the money. I just wanted to see how much he had saved up. It's so funny. It's like I've saved all this money, and you open it, and it's like ten gold. I wish I'd murdered you. I'm looking. No, well, I've taken your savings. Ha ha. Any luck on by the divine hang on to it for now. I must have six before I'll be Oh for fuck's sake. She wants six? Are you kidding me? I have to carry around six bottles of wine? Fuck you, woman. And it weighs a pound each. Damn you. I might see if I can lock it in the chest. Right, let's wait. Uh, for seven hours, eight hours, she should be well asleep. We'll feed. Then I'll fast travel to Wayne and Priory. See if we can drop the wine off. Because I'm not carrying that around with me for the entire fucking adventure. Because it's going to take us ages to find Shadow Banish wine. Right, last time the guard didn't care. Stop looking at me. Don't look at me. Okay, let's go down here, let's cast Ghost Walk. Teehee, he has no idea where I've gone. Let me doff my armor quickly while I'm invisible and he has no clue where I am. <laughs> He's just watching us sleep like a true fucking creepazoid. <laughs> Oh my god, of course he is. That's perfect. Thanks for this. Fucking hell game. Yes, go away. Thank you. For fuck's sake, really? Go up there and stare out the door or something. You're supposed to be guarding the premises, not watching her sleep lovingly. That's a really bad place to sleep as well, by the way. On a bed roll, on the bed right next to an open fire. 
That's fucking asking for it. Your hair's going to catch fire, and you're going to burn to death in the middle of the night. Right, he's gone there. Now he should be able to do it. He's none the wiser, chat. He is none the wiser. Not that he cared last time anyway. And I appear over in this corner suddenly. Shama! He's like, whoa, that was amazing. What an amazing magic trick. Out the way. Please, thank you. Right, fast travel to Wayne and Priory since we're nearby. Uh, drop off all our crap. Whoops, wrong one. We want three. So that's a silver sword that we want to charge at some point. Um... This frost will store in there when we go do the fight against the frost mage for the mage's guild. That's everything else. Yeah, all good. Aelwyn's key can store. Glathe's key we can store. White stallion lodge key we're never going to use again, so that can go. Excuse me. We want to store these dwarven and elven arrows because we don't want to waste them on anything shit. And we've already got 200 arrows. And silver arrows we'll keep for, un for undead and ghosts. Right, over to Chaden Hall. Elven Maiden in Shaden Hall. First, let's check the Mages Guild. Wait, what time is it? Seven in the morning. Yeah, perfect. We'll check the Mages Guild for any um, spells that we can buy. Now that we're a bit more loaded, and there uh, might be something useful. Plus, we need to carry on with the Mages Guild's recommendation, the Chaden Hall recommendation. Talk is free. What do you want? I'm Trayvon. We don't. My I Let me have a look just at my shut up and sell me some spells. I'm sure there's something to suit you. No, water breathing would have been useful, but we've already got a ring for that. It sounds like there are an awful lot of problems at the Bruma Guild Hall. Jean does. What are you talking about? Right, where's that Argonian? Oh, she's right next to Falcor. Have you noticed a change in the well water recently? Tastes strange to me. Yeah, there's a corpse no, in it. Really? No doubt. Falcor's just like, hmm. I hear she and standing she right next to d -san. That's so funny. I hope nothing bad has happened to him. Take care. Rive Lythandas. Yes, leave, Falcor, leave. Go somewhere else. Hi. Hi Good morning. I'm Dietzer. Rife Lathendus is one of the greatest painters in all Cyrodiil. Sadly, he's gone missing. His wife, Tivola, is beside herself with grief. Oh, dear. Did you hear that someone played yet another prank on Jean Fasora? Yeah, that was us. As I've... Can't talk while Falcor's here. Falcor, fuck off. First, the chapel attack. Now the talk is ranting about the... Whatever, let's go. Like you. 
Haven't you taken care? They charged me five gold for littering. Littering? I barely make that in a year. These fines are ridiculous. You barely make five gold in a year when you're a member of the Fighters Guild. You must be fucking useless. Ever since Ulrich Leyland took over the captain of the guard post, this city has gone downhill. It's getting almost scary to walk the streets. Is it? The guards have imposed new ridiculously heavy fines for every infraction under the sun. Infraction they under the sun! They make up laws just for charging fines. Jeez. If you can't pay the fine, they can take your property away or toss you in the castle dungeons. Nothing we can do about it, really. If you're interested, go talk to Lavana Nadarin. She seems the most outspoken against Ulrich and his new fines. Yeah, I can get talked to him. Corruption and conscious. Right Move your ass, Luke. Shut the fuck up. You don't even make five gold a year, you clown. Corruption and conscious over here. She's just standing out here for some reason. You seem far too nice to be. Done with. Oh, please, don't even get me started. That madman won't be satisfied until everyone in town is dead broke or in jail. Is that right? What in oblivion is Ulrich doing with all that money anyway? Prostitutes. I'm sure he's lining his pockets with the gold of the good citizens of Chadenhall. Yep. Take my good friend Aldous Othran, for example. In the last month, he's been fined six times. Six! All for being drunk and disorderly. Have you ever gone past a guard barracks? When are they not drunk and disorderly? <laughs> what kind of stupid fine is That's that? That's so funny. Well, Aldous couldn't pay the last two fines, so they seized his home and threw him into the street until he could pay it. Bastards! The Count... He could care less about our plight. As long as the roast suckling pig is delivered to his feast table, he's as happy as can be. Oh, he's a fatty fatty, is he? Is there anyone who cares? Well, there's one man who seems to care. Garrus Dorelia, the second in command of the guard. I hear he isn't happy with Ulrich. I don't know what you can do for us in this situation. I mean, Ulrich is a captain after all. Perhaps you could speak to Garrus. Okay. You can find him roaming the county hall of the castle most of the time. I will do that then. I don't know where the Count found him, but I sure wish he'd send him back. He's a menace to this town. Poor fellow. You may be able to find him roaming the streets of Chadenhall, probably drunk. Only a month ago, he lost his wife. They were traveling the road from the Imperial City when a bandit raiding party struck. He barely escaped alive. Oh dear. Ever since then, he's been drunk. Sure, he gets rowdy sometimes, but he's never hurt anyone. Garrus may be our... Whoops. Oh, I'm traveling along the side of the bridge for some reason. Oh, I don't like walking across the bridge. I shimmy across the edge of it like a weirdo. There we go. As I was about to say, it's weird there's not much uh, known route around considering how much water there is in Shaden Hall. do you want I can't say I'm prepared to speak to you about oh let me tell you this here joke yes. quickly you'll find it really funny and then you'll want to tell me everything
Okay, so he hates top right. You think I wish I what don't waste your flattery. Don't, don't waste your flattery on me. I have no that's don't please I'm sorry. No, please, I'm that's I'm sorry. A, no more. That's not bad. Not bad. It appears you've spoken to Lavana. I know she sounds a bit like a raving madwoman, but she isn't far from the truth. I didn't think that at all. <laughs> He's like, she's a raving fucking lunatic. We take in exorbitant fines from the people. Where most of the money goes, I have a good idea. Ulrich keeps his quarters locked. But I glimpsed inside. The things he has in there could never be purchased on a captain's salary. At first, I thought maybe he was from wealthy stock. But many of the goods have been delivered recently. I'd love to bring him to task in front of Count Indaris, but I dare not without a solid witness that will speak against him. Honestly, she's never done anything to be fined or get in trouble. Yet, the person I'd love to bring in as a witness is Aldous Arthurin. Okay. That is, if we could sober him up for five minutes. I haven't approached him myself, as Ulrich has eyes everywhere. However... He doesn't know you well enough yet to suspect anything. If you want to help, you need to get Aldos to agree to become a witness. We're good at this. Nothing else can be done. We're really good at this. We rock up into a town, find out there's a bunch of corrupted watchmen, get people to testify against them, get them jailed, and then they show up after, after escaping prison and try and murder us out in the wilderness. We've done this before, chat. It's all good. Aldos is living on the street now that his house has been seized. I begged Ulrich to give him more time, but he wouldn't. He won't be hard to find. Just follow the smell of stale mead. The smell of stale mead. Beware of Ulrich. I wouldn't confront him at this time, as he'll surely have you thrown in jail. Okay. If you raise a hand against him and strike him down, you'll be accused of murder. Even if Ulrich doesn't do things by the letter of the law, I do. Okay, Batman. Jesus. Well, actually, not really Batman, are you? You're more... Uh, what's his name? Gordon. Commissioner Gordon. Alright, let's go find this Aldos drunkard. Is this Ulrich? Yeah, you're going to know me soon, buddy. I'm the corrupt watchman catcher. -er. Yeah, that's right. You heard me. I capture -er corrupted watchmans. And you're on my target list. Just looking for Nernroot. There doesn't seem to be. Oh, there's some. Aha! I spot you, Nernroot. I see you hiding there. You're mine, Nernroot. Oh, there's Aldos. Watch out for the fire, buddy. Who are you? Ha! That stupid switch. Stupid switch. Be out of my home, will he? I'll show him a thing or two about messing with an Othran. Oh, don't do it. All I did was fall down. Sure, maybe even vomited on the floor of the tavern. Charge me six times, Ulrich. Charge me, you fetcher. Oh dear. Well, I'm not standing for this anymore. You come with me, and I'll show you what the Othrans can do when their backs are to the wall. Wait, what are you going to do, buddy? Wait, uh, slow down. Hang on a second. Let's talk about this. No, wait. Let's 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 come to a different conclusion. We can so let's sober you up. Let's get some water, and then you'll think about it. Don't just don't do anything crazy. Don't do anything I wouldn't do, which is pretty much nothing at this point in this game. Yes. But yeah, who are you? Are you a random you have the hands of an illusion. A Magnoc Grokoblok, the Riverside Groundskeeper. Rogmesh. Any rumors? That Gruyan Garana is really full of us. Mm, okay. Yeah, I'm coming. I'm a coming. There's guards everywhere, that's everywhere, though, so be careful. Just don't do anything crazy. Don't do anything too crazy. Morning. Morning. What? This is my house. Get out of the way. Move, Hi. I say. Sir. This property has been seized by his lordship, the Count of Chadenhall. 
Leave immediately. Leave immediately. I said move, or by my ancestors, I'll put you on the ground with a split lip. Sir, I must warn you that threatening a city guardsman is an offense punishable by a fine of no less than 50 gold. Pay, or be jailed. You, Swit, how dare you? Ulrich be damned. He can take his fine and stuff it up his backside. Oh dear. You've been warned. You are now under arrest. Please, come with me. I'll go nowhere with you, Fetcher. Nowhere. Oh, dear. Oh, no. What are you... Oh, splat. Oh, he got fucking wrecked. Yeah, 26 gold on him there. That's not bad. Yeah. Yeah, you're dead. Sorry, mate. Move along, citizen. There's nothing to be done here. Not anymore, not now that you've fucking murdered him. You saw what happened. I had no choice. If you don't like it. Yeah, maybe I will. Is she still over here? Yeah, she's still over here. There she goes. No, that's someone else. There she goes. Wait, don't leave. Is something amiss? You have an ashen look on your face that tells me so. Are you talking to the guard or me? It's you. Is something amiss? Wait, oh, there you are. You have Did an you ashen look. What's wrong? He's dead. Oh, no. They killed him. I can't believe this. Ever since his wife passed at the hands of the bandits, his life has been miserable. Well, he's at peace now. I'd grown to become fond of him. I wanted to take him into my house. But I was afraid. And now look what's become of him. Afraid of what? There are no more options left. Ulrich must be dealt with, and actions speak louder than words. You must do something for me. Uh huh. Go tell Ulrich that I have some information that incriminates him. Tell him to come alone, or he won't get it. Then lead him here. And I'll do the rest. Okay. I'll deal. I'll make the necessary arrangements for his burial. He'll be buried next to his poor wife. Okay, so now we basically have to go and talk to the other guards that we just spoke to and tell him that she's planning something uh, mischievous with Ul Ulrich. She's got something mischievous planned for Ulfric, I should say. And uh, he gives you two options. You can either do it her way, or you can sneak into the barracks and look for something incriminating for Ulfric. Uh, and then you give him, give him the incriminating letter and he arrests Ulfric. I think I'm going to do it her way. Her way is a lot more fun. Plus you get to loot his body and get whatever he's got on him and he might have something good on him. We must put an Aldos will be mourned. I won't sit by and watch the innocent being driven to the brink like that. Something must be done. But without bloodshed. Levana has always been quick tempered. You must reconsider her plan. It can only lead to prison for her and for you. Well, you say that. I swear that Ulrich will pay for this. We must handle this carefully and prove to the Count that he needs to be arrested. Yes. Ulrich has been watching me, so I haven't been able to enact a plan I devised to bring him down. That ends today. Now that you're here. That ends today, chat. The evidence we need to incriminate Ulrich must lie within his quarters. You must sneak in there and retrieve it without being seen. I can do that. I've got invisibility. If you're caught, there isn't anything I can do to help you. Just be careful. You got a key at least? Yeah, nice. Okay. Right, now what I'm going to do is using the key he's given me, I'm going to go into Aldous's place, rob Aldous Ulrich blind. Not Aldous's place, sorry. Rob Ulrich blind. Steal all his stuff, steal all his monies. I think it's here, isn't it? Yeah, it's in here. Get the invisibility, the old invisibility ready just in case. 
Uh, no ghost walk. Take off our armor. Doff all our armor quickly. Right, we're going to steal him blind. Rob him blind even. That's the letter, the suspicious letter that you use to uh, incriminate him. But I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to rob everything I can from him. And then we'll do it her way because you get more out of it. One, it's more entertaining. Two, you get paid only about 50 gold less for doing it her way than you do for doing it his way. Uh, and three, then you can loot his body and get anything he's got on him. And I saw he earlier had a silver battle axe, so that's a good 150 gold in itself. Plus whatever's in here. Seven gold. Oh. Oh well. Get out of here. That was disappointing, considering how much money he's been um, taking from people. Oops, didn't mean to summon a zombie. There's a zombie in town, everyone watch out. <laughs> considering how much uh, gold he's been taking from people, you'd have thought he'd have more stashed away in his room somewhere, but he didn't, unfortunately. So let's just save it. Uh, and then do it her way. Here he is. No, that's not him. Well met. That's not him. Where is he? There he is. Can't you see that I'm busy? Yeah, you're about to be Please. less busy. I don't like being. I don't like being disturbed. Follow me. So, you say Levana wishes to see me? Very well. Lead on. This should prove amusing. Yes, it should. Should indeed. Hello. See this? See? Look at what you've done. This is your fault. He's just standing on his corpse. He doesn't care. All right. Well, we'll see what happens now, fucker. Levana, I hear you have something I'd want to see. Oh, how dare you walk in here like you don't know what's going on. Of course I know what's going on. What intrigues me is that you had the nerve to threaten me. I'm just curious to see what you've come up with. Just because you run the law in this town doesn't put you above it. You're going to pay for what happened to Aldous. Aldous was a drunkard and a fool. He decided to draw a blade and attack a guard, so he paid the price. You bastard. How many more people are going to pay that price? How many more have to die just so you can earn another gold coin? I'm not going to stand here and debate this all night. You give me that evidence, and I'll consider not having you executed. As you wish, Ulrich. Come, my lovelies, your feast! Has arrived. Oh shit, Stains. She paralyzed him. This might take a while. Once Ulrich was led inside Levana's house, she cast some sort of paralysis spell on him. At that point, Levana released some rats upon Ulrich's helpless body that bit into him until he was dead. I should put this to Garus. That's quite funny. Silver battle axe, chainmail boots. You get all the keys as well for Chaden Hall. Which is incredibly useful for obvious reasons. For like sneaking around and uh, looting the place, stealing things, exploring Castle Leowin. Um, exploring Castle Chaden Hall, sorry. Uh, it's very handy having all the keys. Like I said, you don't get that much less. If you do it the other way and have him arrested, he pays you maybe like a hundred less gold as a bounty for doing for helping them out. That's literally all that happens.
We must put an end. Yes, we already have. Yes. I'm very disappointed in you. I'm sure you are. The proper way to do this would have been my way, but you chose bloodshed. Damn right, I did. I should have you arrested. Yeah, well, you're not going to, are However, you, pussy? Since you're fully at fault, I won't report your involvement to the Count. Lavana, on the other hand, will pay for her crime. Oh dear. I'll ensure that her stay in jail is not long. So he's still happy. He's still happy with you. Look how smiley he is. So I'll do what I can on her behalf. Look, he's happy. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must speak to the Count. Please, meet me at the Chadenhall Bridge Inn in two hours. Okay. While you're distracted and preoccupied with that, I'm going to go steal the bust of Lady Leowin. I'll do it after in case it interferes or messes up the quest at all. Let's uh, sell some stuff in here. Yes? Yes? We'll see. Oh, no, we can't disposition her anymore. So let's Have just a sell. Look at my wares. I'm sure there's something to suit Silver Battle Axe 61. Chainmail boots. Oh, it equates you to about trust? the same, but you get all That's the keys. Yeah, it equates about the same amount of gold. But, like I said, you get all the keys off him for Castle Chadenhall, which is really useful. By every right. The right of freedom of speech. And general freedom amongst the populace. Is that more Nernroot? I think I just saw more Nernroot over here somewhere. No, it was that. It was that sticking out of the rock. Any spells? I am Gruyang in that capacity. Trading in speechcraft. No thanks. Okay, you need to doff the armor once more. Invisibility makes the Thieves Guild so simple. Sneaking in the Thieves Guild. Grab the bust. Grab the stuff from in here. Oh, shit sticks. Turn invisible, then come back out. And now we're good. That guard is down trapped in there with the fucking ghost of what's a face. That's really funny. He's not going to survive long. Check the Fighters Guild while we're waiting for the guy to show up. See if there's anything here worth stealing slash taking. Loads of ingredients.
couple of steel weapons we can sell. Any repair hammers in here? We're running a bit low on repair hammers. Oh, there's a lockpick. Another lockpick. Love it how people leave lockpicks just lying around all over the place. No wonder there's so much thievery in these fantasy games. Hi. 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 Morrowind has always been a trouble. <clears throat> I'm with Count Indaris, and I have news for you. After speaking to the Count and reviewing your testimony, we decided to reduce Lavana's sentence as she was acting for self-preservation. Self-preservation? She paralyzed someone and let them get eaten alive by rats. How is that self-preservation? That's so funny. The Count and I thank you for helping bring Ulrich's hold on Chaden Hall to an end. Though we would have preferred having him brought upon charges. Yeah, well he got ate by rats, so. As a token of our gratitude, as... You did this at the risk of false imprisonment, or perhaps your life. We reward you this bounty of gold. Yay, a bounty. On behalf of the people of Chadenhall, I thank you. 375, yeah, I think he gives you 450. He gives you 450 if you do it his way. You got any rumors for Mariana me? Mariana and Sharia, hostess of Shadenhall Bridge... I spoke with Dietzan at the Mage's Guild. Re nope. Goodbye. Speaking of the Mage's Guild, let's go back there and see if Falcar has banished, has disappeared out of earshot so I can get the spell that she gives you. It might be a spell, it might be a scroll, I can't remember, but I obviously want to go and do the, um, the Chadenhall mission while we're up here. And I can't do that fully until Falcar fucks off, right? Good day. We can talk so long as Falcar is out of your shot. If I didn't know any better, I'd say he's trying to get you killed. Is he? He gave poor Vidkin the same task, and we never saw him again. Oh dear. I'm reasonably sure there's a connection, but I can't prove it. Want me to prove it? I can prove it. I'm good at proving stuff. I hate to lose another useful associate. Here's the key, and something extra. I don't know if it will be of use to you, but from what I've heard of Falcar's ring, it may come in handy. That's a bit of extra gold, I'll take it. If you find out anything about what happened to Vidkun, let me know, will you? Yeah, sure. Buoyancy, the spell added. So you get a spell off her. You also get the well key, which you don't have, which you need to get into the well in the first place. So, yeah, I did have to talk to her. Right, there's some Nern root over here. Pick up the Nern root. And then Vidkin's body, and that's it. Ring of Burden. You look like a bright one. I am a bright one. I'm afraid some things have happened while you've been gone, Associate. It may affect your recommendation. Oh dear. What happened? What did you do? What did you I do? Admit it's my doing. I couldn't leave well enough alone. No, you couldn't. After you'd left to go after that ring. Well, I'm just so tired of the way we've all been treated by Falcar. I was worried about you and angry about Vidkun, so I confronted Falcar directly. He 
He was furious when I told him I'd help you. And then when I threatened to report him to the Council of Mages, I thought he was going to kill me. He flew into a rage. I didn't even understand some of his ranting, but he said that our days are numbered, and then he stormed out. I don't know if he ever wrote your recommendation. I'm sorry. I didn't expect this to happen. Perhaps you should go look and see if he did write one. You should check his room in the living quarters. If you see the note or anything else unusual, let me know. I'll gladly send it to the council. Cool. Works for me. Black soul gems. No way, chat. Potion of feather. Consume health. Major heal other. Uh, we'll drop off the ring here because it's garbage. Doesn't do anything. Just weighs. What's this? Black soul gems? Yep. Oh dear, this is worse than I'd expected. All right, I'll just take these from you. I'll need them for my report to the council. Now, you didn't find any sort of recommendation? Very well. I shall write one myself and include it in my report to the council. In light of the circumstances, I believe they'll find it more than adequate. Good. All right, catch you later. Bye. I, it's my pleasure. Any spells? Oh, she can recharge Always stuff. Keep your How much will it cost? 500 gold. Charge. Fuck that. We'll wait. We'll wait. 500 gold to charge, recharge the weapon for five damage a swing. No thanks. Right. I think that's everything we can do in Shadenhall for the moment. We don't want to do the, the uh, brush with death is too difficult. You fight painted trolls, which just absolutely eradicate you until we're stronger. So... I think we just want to head to to um, head up to Bruma where we sell all the stuff we stole, uh, and then head back down to the Imperial City waterfront to hand in the Thieves Guild mission. I'm really t take your time. Take your time. I yeah, will. My thank you. Customer. What are Steel you battle axe. Steel mace. I think I can move this item. Brass rings. I not worth shit. I think Bronze I can. amulet. Oh, is that all we stole? I thought we had more stuff. Major heal other. You got a great deal there. No, that was it. Okay, that was that wasn't uh, worth coming here for. I thought we'd stolen more stuff, but the battle axe and the mace turned out weren't stolen. Okay, let's head to this Imperial City waterfront. Huh? No, I'm not going to go visit him now or anything. Why do you ask? What time is it? Perfect. One in the morning. <gasps> He's not here, chat. And there's a guardsman right there. What's going on? And everyone's looking for Armand Christoph. The waterfront is crawling with Imperial Watch. They're all looking for Armand Christoph. I'm sure he won't show at midnight. Daryloth's garden, garden is too hot. I'll need to find out where he is hiding. Maybe one of the other Thieves Guild members knows. I'll have to start asking around for them. Right. I think it's in here. Methodel's house. Who can see me? No one now. Right. I think Methodel should be in here. And Dardel. 
followers of the Grey Fox. Well, whilst we're here, let's wait. Oh, you can't wait while trespassing. Let's wait for an hour. That'll cause our vampirism to go up. Then we can go in and eat. No, maybe not. Have you seen Armand Christoph? No, and if I did, I wouldn't tell you, you fucking pig. And I spit in his face. Okay, I don't know where she is. Let's go talk to a beggar. Oh wait, I heard her. I just heard her. I'm only. I just heard Methrides. Where is she? Have you seen Armand Christoph? Nothing so far. No sign of Armand Christoph. Okay, I don't know where Method is, is. But guys, we are coming to the end of the episode, so I'm going to have to wrap things up there for now. And we will find out what's going on here and find Armand Christoph. There she is. Whoa. I assume you know that Hieronymus Lex has issued an arrest warrant for Armand Christoph. Oh. Where is Armand Christoph? He is in hiding. Armand is accused of stealing the bust of Lathasa Indaris from Chaden Hall. They say Count Indaris himself filed the charges. Ah, oh, really? So what do I do with the bust? There never was a client that commissioned the guild to steal Lathasa's bust. Armand used you to flush out an informant that infiltrated the guild. Ah. Oh. Who's the informant? Mavrina Arano. Now Armand needs your help to neutralize her. You're going to pin the... Okie dokie, how? Plant the bust in her cupboard. Make sure she doesn't see you. Then go tell Hieronymus Lex that she is the thief. A brilliant plan. There are no oh, flaws in that whatsoever. I have to persuade him. <laughs> he probably won't believe Hopefully you. You don't say. go and check it out. Okie dokie. Shadow hide you. Where the fuck did you come from? Jesus, lady. Right, guys. That's the end of the episode. We're going to carry on with this Thieves Guild mission at the start of the next episode which will be online tomorrow morning thank you so much for hanging out today i hugely appreciate it i hope you're enjoying the series i'm gonna be back tomorrow with another episode of oblivion so hopefully i'll see you all there for that guys if not i'll try and catch you in some other content i produce i try and make content every single day now so sal wait till next time